This morning we continue our series, Coffee with the Candidates, to help you get to know the candidates running for office in the upcoming elections on a personal level. Joining us this morning is Democratic candidate for Providence Mayor, Angel Tavares. Good morning, Angel. How are you? Good morning. Welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. All right, so you're an attorney and uh, have a nice, uh, normal job, right? Mm -hmm. Things are peace and quiet in your life, but you want to be the mayor. Why? I, I do. We have a great city in Providence, and I've been fortunate to live all around the city uh, to get a good education, to go on uh, and become a lawyer, and I want to make sure more people have that opportunity. Now, 10 years ago, you so this isn't your first foray into the public arena. Talk about 10 years ago, and it didn't work out, but why now do you want to give it another try? Uh, Ten years ago, <clears throat> excuse me, I ran for Congress, and uh, it was an uh, amazing experience to meet so many people around the state. And now I feel that I have an opportunity to make a difference in the lives of uh, the people of Providence and to make sure that a lot of our kids have the opportunities that I've had and to help grow our economy in the city uh, so that people can, uh, parents can raise their children with dignity like my mom did. Growing up in the city and, and when you grew up to now, what kind of motivated you as you, you know, looking around saying, you know, there's, I think I can make a change? You know, more than anything uh, is the belief that we live in the greatest country in the world and um, here there is no limit. The sky's the limit. And I'm an example of that. So I look at it and know that you can achieve if you work hard uh, and you believe in yourself. Talk about this city uh, and, and, how, and, and how much it's changed and, you know, the renaissance and everything. It, it's become one of the more attractive places to live and work. But with this unemployment and, and, and now the negative vibe that goes along with the city, is it something that can be fixed? Absolutely. Um, and I want to make sure that Providence is an example of what you can do in terms of economic development, right. education reform, in terms of public safety. I want people to look at Providence as a good example around the country, and I believe we can do that. All right, Angel, thanks so much for coming in this morning in our Coffee with the Candidates segment. Nice to meet you. Good luck uh, this month. Thank and, you. Uh, we'll see you, of course, down the road. Thanks for joining us. To learn more about Tavares' take on political issues, head over to foxprovidence.com for much more. Time